I'm Eric Birch with MiningClips.com, and this is your Daily Market Debrief for Wednesday, February 3rd, 2016. The day started off rough, with stocks and oil trading lower only to reverse mid-session and all close in the green, surprising most traders, especially since the U.S. oil inventories grew from 4.4 million barrels a couple of weeks ago to 7.8 million barrels reported today. Gasoline inventories also beat street estimates of 2.5 million barrels, clocking in at 6 million barrels. There is more oil in the U.S. than is being used. The Dow came back from almost a 200-point deficit to close up 183 points at 16,336. The S&P also closed up 9.5 points at 1,912, with the Nasdaq down 12 points to close at 4,504. European equities did not fare as well, posting a third day of consecutive declines. Canadian equities, although, followed suit with the U.S. as the TSX gained 150 points to end the day at 12,593. The Canadian dollar was also on the move, gaining a penny and a third to close at 72.61 cents as the greenback hit a three-month low against the euro. In metals, New York spot gold was up by $13.40 an ounce today to close at $1,142.40 an ounce. This is a three-month high for gold, and it may go higher yet. Silver also saw some action today, moving up $0.39 to close at $14.68 an ounce. High-grade copper moved up nicely by $0.04 to close at $2.09 a pound, according to COMEX data. More volatility is expected as earnings week continues. For MiningClips.com, I'm Eric Birch.